baby, don't check for me. Taking time out to be and live my life off screen. Hey guys, it's Sharika. We're starting today's vlog off with a hair sponsor from Beauty Forever. So thank you so much for sponsoring today's video. The first thing they sent me was a Christmas card. They sent over a wig cap, clamps, the scarf, 3D lashes, and let's get into the hair. I was shocked when I opened this box, but we are gonna give it a try. So let's take a look at this. This is a 13 by four straight ombre highlight lace unit. It is 24 inches long and 150% density. Okay, and then this is inside the unit. It looks like the knots are bleached for me. So I love that because I usually just put foundation around this part, but the knots came bleached, so that's a plus. Um, now, of course, it comes with the combs on each side of the unit. So here's one right here, and then we have one on the other side. Of course, you have one in the back along with the lace tab, just in case you wanna wear it in a ponytail. And then it comes with the adjustable strap. So we're gonna go ahead and apply this. I'm so nervous, but I think it'll look good. And here's how the hair turned out. I ended up putting some wand curls in the hair. It's so cute. I really, really like the way that it look. I've been playing in this hair all morning long. It's so cute. I was so nervous at first because you guys know I don't usually wear color, but I love the way it turned out. Here, I'm just showing you guys two different ways that I will wear it. The flip over method, which is really sexy, and then the normal way, the part down the middle, which I always do, um, but it looks good either way. I'll link all the information to this hair in the description box below. Hey guys, it's Sharika. Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe before you leave. So on today's video, we're going to do a what I eat in a day. Um, a lot of you guys always request that I do a little more cooking on my channel. I guess you guys like the way that I cook. So I'll be doing that. I'll be including what I eat in a day on my channel once a week. I think it'll be a lot of fun. I'll just basically show you guys what I eat throughout the day. Every week is not going to be the same. Sometimes I might go out and I'll just show you guys what I'm eating for um, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Breakfast, lunch, snack, dinner, however I do it. I'll just show you guys what I do or what I eat throughout the day. Now, usually I'm not a big breakfast person. Some days, depending on how early I ate the day before, um, I might wake up and I might be a little hungry and I might have something, but usually I don't have breakfast. Like it is probably close to one o'clock and I still haven't had anything to eat yet because I just, it takes me a while to get hungry. But when I get there, girl, I get there, okay? <laughs> I get there. So um, what y'all think about this hair color? Like, I really, really like it. I was so nervous at first. Y'all know I don't really play in color like that. I feel a little more comfortable when the roots are darker. But this is a big change, but I really like it. Right now, I'm getting ready to fix myself a wrap. And I'm going to take you guys in the kitchen so you guys can watch me make it. So let's go in the kitchen. These are the wraps that I'll be using for today. I got these from Publix. Um, they're whole wheat wraps and five grams of protein. I really don't pay any attention to that, really. Um, I just wanted to try something different. And honestly, they're a little hard. On the hard side I don't really like them all that much so I probably won't buy these again but because I have them I'm gonna go ahead and use them these are the ones that we usually get from Walmart Publix wherever they sell these in the grocery store um, and Tony just bought some more last night so get this brand <laughs> and then I like to go to Publix to get 
the lemon pepper chicken breast. Only type of cheese that I have, the monster cheese. I really like the way this cheese melts. It gives a good cheese pull, but the taste is not so great. Um, but again, I only have two slices in here and I need to use it. So usually we'll put this on something else along with other cheeses. Um, because like I said, it does give a great cheese pull, but the taste is not giving. And I'm going to do some mushrooms, a tomato. We're going to do some baby spinach. And I like to use a little bit of cream cheese and mayo. And I'll also add some pickles. saute my mushrooms instead of putting putting them on their raw and then I'll just add some everyday seasoning from Trader Joe's and a little bit of garlic So here is lunch, my little wrap. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and enjoy this. I have my water and I'll see you guys back here for dinner. Okay, y'all, so I just got back home from picking up my son. So now I'm getting ready to dinner before I start that I want to show you guys something that I got um, if you guys remember my birthday blog I was looking for these little chafing dishes I got these probably like two weeks ago um, but y'all remember I wanted to have these for <laughs> excuse me I wanted to have these for my birthday party um, just because they're so nice and fancy when you're um, hosting like a dinner party or something like that. I got these from um, Bed Bath & Beyond. I've been wanting to get these for the longest time and I ordered them in December. I got them for $40 each. They're so cute. So I bought two of them. Um, but I just have them on my counter right now because Tony's going to take them to the garage. I'm just, I probably never use these unless I'm having something at my house. Um, but these are just super cute so i had to show y'all i love them so much so for dinner i'm actually cheating tonight because these are already made for me but i get these um lump crab cakes from fresh market they're so good it's a lot of crab it's just a little bit of breading not a lot um but they're bomb if you guys have a fresh market and you don't feel like making them yourself get them from fresh market trust me they are a little pricey but they're worth it but i have to cook these up because i got these saturday and today is wednesday so or i got these sunday and today is wednesday so i need to go ahead and cook them and then i'm gonna do some asparagus which i messed up a little bit because 
I bought these from Costco. I bought two bags of these on Christmas and I wasn't too sure when I was going to eat them again and I didn't want them to go bad. So I put them in the freezer. I don't really like frozen asparagus because you miss out on that crunch. It makes it a little soggy when you freeze them. But I have a little bit left. So I'm going to go ahead and cook these up. Um, I like to cook my asparagus with mushrooms. It's so bomb. And then I'm going to do some mashed potatoes. So that's what I'm having for dinner tonight. So let's get started on that. Okay, so dinner is done. Have my crab cake, my mashed potatoes, and I like to add this or they have like a lemon butter or lemon, I think it's like a lemon butter. Um, it's really good too on crab cakes, but I'm using this one. This time that's what I have over the crab cake and it's really good. So. This is dinner. I'm going to go ahead and fix myself a glass of wine. So I just pulled this one from out of the freezer. Um, Cab Zen. It's a Cabernet. I got this from Cooper's Hawk. Y'all know I'm a wine member there. And this is my first time trying this one. So this is the wine that I'll be having tonight. y'all 
Mm. Okay, y'all. So that is it for today's video. My first what I eat in a day series on my channel. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I think we're going to have a lot of fun doing this, sharing new recipes. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. So I'm really excited for it. So just look out for these every week, once a week. And I'm going to go ahead and enjoy my dinner. I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram. I am Sharika B. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Love y'all.